We are in what's called Dance House in Dublin. It's um, a purpose-built studio dance space. So we're pretending we're dancers. We are dancers. Celtic Woman, we've got five girls, Lisa, Chloe, Alex, Lynn, and Mairead, a fiddle of course. And uh, with, with each of them comes a very different approach to music, uh, a very different background, a very different voice. And that's what makes it so interesting. We're, we're very blessed with uh, five of the most talented uh, women I've ever, I've ever worked with or ever known. This is my first time doing a DVD, so I've seen all the other girls doing it, and I can't believe I'm going to actually get to be on it now. So I'm very excited. I have never been on any of the DVDs before, so it's a first for me. It's me again. I've been here from the very start. So this is our one, two, three, this is our fourth DVD. So we're kind of getting good at it now. We know what we're supposed to be doing. On applause and in the gap reposition. There's a good buzz about this one, you know, because I guess it's been so long since we did our last big DVD shoot that we're really excited for this one because we all know we're just going to have a great time. There's some really amazing new numbers. I just love the arrangements that David has done. They're fantastic. The one thing that I love to do is to write new music for the girls, to arrange old songs, new songs. There's something there for everyone, which has been, you know, our success, I think, from day one, is that, you know, people can come along and enjoy themselves. Um, and it doesn't matter what kind of music you like, you'll, you'll enjoy something out of there. an entirely new show, two hours of new, brand new music, and you can imagine the amount of time that that takes to, to put together, to write, to, to arrange, all of that. Um, so it's, it's a massive, massive undertaking. True Colours, Galway Bay. I know we haven't done Chloe, but we'll just walk what we had said we were going to do. My, my enjoyment out of it is seeing when we go into the studio and David plays me the tracks first, and seeing it progress into the rehearsal studio like this. But we love to, to move around, and Darren is, Darren is great. His movements are fantastic. The audience are all in around, oh, so you, be, you can be playing to them rather yeah, than actually yeah. playing to the band. It's a different concept when it comes to film rather than stage show. So what we're trying to do is an awful lot of the angles and everything will be definitely more minuscule. I, I think the shots will line up better with David and with the choir if you guys are further downstage. The choir are just going to do a music, a quick run through all the music that the choir have to sing. Dancing is fine on its own, and then the singing is fine on its own, and then when you're told to put it together, then all of a sudden you've got so many things running through your head of what to do. Then five is that one. That's when I get to Okay, so we cross one. We're on page 28. In the paper. What? See? In your underwear. I got a tick. I paid them to put that in there today. It's a lovely picture. It's a gorgeous picture of you, Chloe. Go split uh, two girls either side, yeah? But you can see that it's not even finished. The lengths are definitely longer than we are here, so I think okay. a lot of the walking is going to be longer than you think. We're nearly there. Nearly there. It's, there's always the time when you want to go from the rehearsal studio to on site because there's only so much you can do in the studio. You need to see it in situ now. So we're here in Powers Court House and Gardens where we're planning to shoot a brand new television special and DVD commercial release, Celtic Woman Songs from the Heart here. To kind of come back here to a place that I've grown up with and, you know, that I take visitors to Ireland to see every time they're over. You know, we always take them to Powers Court to walk the gardens, see the house. So to, to put on our own show here, it's very special. We went through a few locations and ended up here, which is the most beautiful and challenging location I've ever seen. Nothing's flat. Everything's rolling hills and ledges and cliffs. Alan, it's not symmetric, is it? No, it's not. Was it on the drive? No, never. Oh, okay. That answer that question. Yeah. There you go. 
Yeah, well, crisis averted. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> what we were trying to do was to avoid having to put in uh, a classic square rectangular type stage with a set on that and rather integrate the shape of the set into, the, into its surroundings. The challenge is the shape of the, the hill. As you can see the rake, every individual item has to be cut, levelled and braced. So it's been a challenge all day and hard work. We're trying to fix his mistakes. <laughs> it should take quite a while. There's been a few difficult moments, but nothing that a pen to Guinness can't cure. <laughs> <laughs> Just can't leave me in peace, Emma. <laughs> I think Paris Court, uh, this, this production, is the biggest, it's certainly the biggest production we've ever done, by far. I've never seen so many people all working away on, on the different elements of it. We've added, you know, pipes and drums and pyro and all kinds of stuff. I think there's more people on stage than in the audience. Trying to light the whole surroundings has, has not been a challenge because I've been coming to this gardens for like 34 years and uh, always wanted to light the place. I think he's got like 280 lights out here. I mean, everywhere you look, there's lights. There's a lot of ground to cover when we're rigging all this stuff, especially down at the lake. It's all for the camera, but it's all to try and capture the whole beauty of Paris Court, so you need a lot of stuff. Okay. Yeah, Elizabeth Kelly is a, is a co-producer, so you have to talk when you're a co-producer, you can't I'm hide. actually going right now because they're putting the pyro in the wrong spot, and they want to make See, sure that See, producer's never work is never done, isn't that right? That's there? true. Yeah. Because these are not going to stay here, right? Thing, yeah. or the question, I guess the question or, or request is that we have four here and five over there. It's been a little bit crazy working here at Powers Court. It's a great place, but you know, it's a different country. Um, we've got hundreds of people on our crew. The weather is insane. It rains. It's sunny. They're just being it's tested. It's a semi-circle. They're just being tested. Sure, okay. We're doing our best, but and we're hoping that the sun stays out, but um, you never know in Ireland. See, you were going, he was going to dance. Today is Tuesday, and this is the first major tech day, so um, it'll be fun because it'll be the first time we've all heard the music, and it'll be the first time we've been on the stage. So um, it's cutting it a bit fine. Tomorrow night is the show. We have Arizona Gold Metallic Spray for the, for the layering of the set, you know. A bit of sparkle, a bit of feminine magic. You know. If it doesn't sparkle, it ain't on this show. Magic, magic. Scenery's beautiful, good weather. Americans aren't bad, are eh? Let's start, sorry. This is nice and big. Our three cameras, our three main close up principal cameras. The first impressions looks great. Looks great, nice and big. That's what I always like to see. How are you, How are you feeling? How's nice things? Good, man. Everybody's here, the choir is here. I saw David arriving just before I got here, and I could hear a little bit of a sound check down there. Rachel is our Celtic woman number six. She's our tour manager the on wicked tour. The witch. She's the wicked witch. She keeps us all in check. <laughs> Maraid's calling. <laughs> she can't open the door. <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> That's a good start to the day. Getting locked in my trailer. You always lock the girls in the trailers. <laughs> hey, I keep them on time that way. <laughs> If anyone Jones. wants to get locked <laughs> in the trailer, <laughs> it would be right as yeah. yes. We're about to go and see the stage now, though. So I should probably stop messing. So this is the stage? Hey! I'm, I'm stunned. I'm stunned. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I can't believe the view. It's probably the most beautiful place we've ever played in. You didn't even get a 99 for me. I'm that's sorry, a, that's, I'll get a, you that's what we call a 99, that cone, which yeah. is a cone with a Cadbury's flake, which is the most fabulous chocolate. That's why I came back to Ireland for the ice cream. Yes. Yes. Hi, Tom. I hope you're happy. Yeah. Look what you made me do. <laughs> This is my enjoyment. Darren, yeah. we're going to sound check, but should we do it? No, no, we'll do it in situ. Yeah. In situ. Okay. Scori all trail confine, fume non che pu. Now you're going to ask me what it means. <laughs> ask Rosemary what tracks to do for the choir. Yeah. And then we just need to get the girls in.
It's just down, um, there's a few drops of rain. I'm just a little bit concerned. No, it's not for the sandwiches, Tom. No, it's not. I it was because a we're eating those. Oh, okay, all right. <laughs> Are you doing our shopping now yet? Most hideous thing I've ever worn. It covers up my T-shirt too. Do you like my T-shirt? Everything is, is great and it's there as a base, but feel free to deviate, feel free to simplify, feel free to do whatever you want. And so let's go get out of the rain. It's raining a lot. My concern is, is, is you know, weather forecasts are weather forecasts. Can we go up to the ballroom now with Darren and the girls and the choir? and utilize it before dinner. Great concept doing an outdoor shoot in Ireland in summer. As you can see, we're here in this beautiful hall in the main house here at Paris Court, and we're practicing our Neil Shane Law. I actually really like the rain. I like looking out the window and, and seeing the rain. Fortunately, as you can see, um, we've been washed out here today, which is uh, a bit of a pain. It looks like in the Wicklow area, which is where we are, it looks like it's going to be brightening up tomorrow afternoon with a good evening. So we're, we're feeling really positive, you know? It's, it's frustrating, but you must move on. You can't let this dampen your spirits, so to speak. It's sent to try us. It's kind of like all these little things. Um, but it'll make us bigger and better and stronger for tomorrow now. To God, the sun is shining, huh? This is the show day, yeah. And uh, lots of nerves, lots of uh, adrenaline, it's fantastic. Because your entrance was... I'm so sorry, I have no recollection. Comes out there. Because we do a weave. We didn't get to do our run-through yesterday okay, at all so because it was a total washout. So we didn't get any rehearsal yesterday. So we're all a bit panicked today. We have good weather. There's blue skies over there. And um, everybody's praying and... Uh, keeping all their fingers crossed so we can do no more except try and enjoy ourselves. Uh, it's I love rock and roll. Very nervous today. Very nervous. Really, really nervous. Are we actually going to do some work? We're doing it now. We're starting. Oh, I'm not ready. To start. Dave's not ready. We got a bear on here, traditional Irish drum. Played like so. a few spots that have been expanding and some of the plywood is starting to ripple in spots but uh, nothing that we can't take care of. Ready? Two, five, four, go three, two. two, one, go. Oh, Danny boy, the pipes, the pipes are calling. Two shot, on, three shot on four. Yeah. So then girls have one more And then you got the full wide down the line on that lead. Yeah, we're doing really well today. I can't believe the weather's holding out. It's brilliant, really great. Gosh, I'm nearly afraid to say anything. <laughs> You'll hear us, you know yeah. where it is. Yeah. yeah. All right? Great. Yeah. Okay. Literally finishing up now. Um, they're more or less ready to go, I hope. It's all up to them now. Let's just hope it stays like this, man. Well, I'm going to be covering it up pretty quickly, but lashes, but hopefully it'll be okay. This is Lucy. Lucy hey. who? Hmm. Most days with Lucy are yeah. good hair day in fairness. She's pretty good. Even when it rains. She's great. Come back in 20 minutes and then I will stare into your camera all day long. Okay, sit on it. And then if it starts to rain, the first thing you do is you cover your instrument. And We're going to have to pull them off. Okay, orchestra are going to have to go, but we can continue with the... Uh... Well, we're only started. <laughs> Slightest drop of rain, we just need to get these things covered up straight away now to protect them for the show tonight. Little rain. <laughs> Never stopped anyone. <laughs> well, maybe us. Stop the rain. I know you're going to be up there, but you stand by now. It's a disaster. It's switched off, is it? Yeah, but it's too much rain. Or... Right now it is 5.10 and I don't see any break in sight. I am stoked. 5,000 miles just for Celtic women. I've seen them five times. You've seen them five times at the States. <laughs> Looking forward to it. 
I hope we get something tonight. Uh, these people made a trip, a lot of them from America, to be here. Where are you guys from? Tucson, Tucson Arizona. Arizona. Arkansas. 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 Texas. Valdez, Alaska. Leipzig, Germany. <laughs> Washington. Germany. 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 Washington. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hi. We're still kind of making believe it's not happening, crossing our fingers and hoping we don't have to cross that bridge, but we're uh, less than an hour to showtime. The contingency is it's gonna stop. Myself and God. See, your, look at that! In your lips, to God's ears. Yeah. We're totally there. It's just a matter of getting there and doing, getting on the stage and doing it now. Right now, we're just waiting for the girls to get dressed. We have three dressed, and we have another two that we're in the middle of. Here we are. This is crazy. amazing. This wow. is the other one that we dyed lace to match. Then we're gonna mic them up, get them in the car. Hopefully the rain will stay off, and we'll get them down. No, we're still bang on schedule. <laughs> we just have to hope Mother Nature is. <laughs> we are recording this show as live. Hopefully with as few stops as possible. We have a dry spot, so we can go. This is very exciting. Yeah, yes, it's, it's gonna be great. Nervous. Nervous. I had a bit of a costume malfunction there. The obligatory drama, you know, before a performance. But I think it's okay now. Hi. Bye. 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 That's all for you out there tonight. We want you to sing along, we want you to clap, and we want you to cry, we want you to do whatever you feel you want to do. Okay, my stage in four. So we start with eleven online, yeah. Two, one, go. Will be coming in next one. He's the okay, one let's get context on him. Let's get over there. We went sailing on a man. What's happened? I'm not sure. Does anyone have a torch? <laughs> Does anyone have a torch? Everything that could go wrong is possibly going wrong. Terror is gone and the front of the house terror is down apparently. They don't know what's wrong. A couple of our audience members are shining a little light for us to assist us. Hey, welcome. <laughs> Somebody has just said in my ear, ladies and gentlemen, do not fear to make the problem solved. Another generator on the way and we're going to get it switched over and the show will go on momentarily. They just got it back. Is it back working? Thank you very much for bearing with us. You're very good. Take your seats, please. Thank you. See? Show must go on. All right, I'm seeing him. I'm seeing him. Start getting to him. Ready now. Tonight. We had a few problems, but a uh, few technical difficulties, but we made it. It was great, and the weather stayed. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, my heart is kind of going. It was fantastic. Hi! That was amazing! Woo! We survived! And we're dry! Oh, the audience, oh, they were so good, you know? And 
was a really great yeah, fight. It was great. <laughs> I thought we were just so lucky. I mean, we must have had somebody looking down on us because the rain stopped just in time. If that's not angels looking down on you, I don't know what is.